Hello and welcome to the stamp camp. Today I'm going to show you how to make this graduation card. It's just a regular card but the little hat on the front actually opens up too and it says the tassel was worth the hassle. So today what I'm going to show you is how to create this little pop-up graduation hat. So you are going to start with a piece of paper that is cut three and three quarters by three and three quarters. I use regular copy paper just because it's easier to bend and fold and it will it will lay flatter on your card. You can make the hat in all different sizes. All you have to do is make sure that you have a square, completely square piece of cardstock or paper. This one I cut four by four and it's a little bigger than what I would like, so I cut it three and three quarters by three and three quarters. Um, the card I had on my blog yesterday, I cut three by three, so I made a smaller hat yet. But to get started, what you're going to do is you're going to fold this in half, like so. Unfold it, fold it in half the other way. So now when you open it up, you have four of the same size square. And then you're going to fold it diagonally once, point to point, like so. Now I just want to fold it back on itself the other way just to, it makes it pop up easier. You're going to take these two folded pieces like this, bring them up, and then flatten it. And there you have the pop-up hat. So what I did is I took some stays on and the tassel was worth the hassle. It's from the Pure Gumption stamp set. And I just stamped that inside like that. Then I took a piece of black and I cut this two inches by two inches. Fold this back up. Take some adhesive and put adhesive all the way around. And then center that on one piece of the black. And then on this one, what you're going to want to do is you can find the center, which would be about one inch by one inch because it's a two inch square. So put a hole in it. I made this little tassel out of the white baker's twine and I have a video on my blog that shows how to make the tassels. If you subscribe to my blog, which is right here. In the left hand top corner, if you click on subscribe, then once you have subscribed to my blog, if you go to the search in the left hand sidebar and you put in graduation or tassel, your the video will come up. So what I'm doing is I'm just taking these ends and I'm poking them so that I can beat it through to the back like that. I want my tassel to come down a little bit. On the back side I'm going to put some adhesive and I'm going to put those ends down and then I'm just going to cut them. Take a brad, stick that down. inside, fan that out in the back, and I have the top of my hat. Put my adhesive on here, make sure I have it opening correctly, and then I can put my task, my, just match up the black to the black on the bottom. And there you have your 
pop-up hat. Now to put that on a card, I took a piece of white and I'm going to stamp here's to a bright future graduate. This is from the Pure Gumption stamp set and I'm just going to stamp that right here. Whoops. I'm going to stick that to a piece of real red cardstock. Oops, I'm out of tape. Can you go get me another one, Dean? So I'm going to go ahead and attach that down. And then I am going to use the square lattice folder and place that in there. Bring my big shot in here. Whoops, that's not good. Okay, get us back in focus. Okay, are we good? We're not jerking no more. Put my plate on and run that through. Technical difficulties. So, doesn't that look cool when it's ran through like that? The base of my card is black, so I'm going to go ahead and fold that in half. I have a piece of white for the inside. Please don't try to move it like that when it gets too jerky. And then go ahead and put a good amount of adhesive on the back because you ran it through the texture folder, it does curl. And go ahead and stick that to the front. The last thing, you can either use dimensionals or just stick it right to the front. Just do a little adhesive. I usually just use a little glue dot just to stick that tassel so it's not flip flopping around. But there you have a really quick graduation card with this fun pop up on the front. So there you go. Thanks for stopping by.